Breaking news. Karen Reed, the woman from Mansfield, charged with murder for allegedly hitting her boyfriend, Boston police officer John O'Keefe, with her SUV and then leaving him for dead, was in court today for a pretrial hearing. WBC's Laura Hayfley is outside Norfolk Superior Court with the very latest. Laura? Well, today's hearing in part determining what happens next in both these pre-trial proceedings and potentially trial proceedings as well, including what evidence is used and what witnesses will testify. A significant decision was made, though, just moments ago in regards to those pre-trial proceedings, and that's that there will not be an evidentiary hearing which is a procedure to determine whether or not there's enough evidence to even move on to a full-blown trial. That hearing will not happen. So what does that mean for this case? It means that at least tomorrow, we will not hear from two witnesses, Brian Albert, who owned the home where John O'Keefe died, and his sister-in-law, Jennifer McCabe. Karen Reed's defense claiming those two testimonies play a crucial role in understanding this case in its full scope, though their cell phone records could still be subpoenaed. That is a decision the court will make. Now, one person we did hear from today for the first time, Karen Reed herself, doubling down, of course, saying she did not do this. She wants to know who did. Said appeals were the only ones fighting for the truth of what happened to John O'Keefe. And me and my family and my attorneys and my team have marshaled every resource to get to the truth. It just feels like no one else wants it. And Karen, just to be clear, you didn't do it. We know who did it, Steve. We know. And we know who spearheaded this cover-up. You all know. Yes, we do. And no, she didn't do it. No, she didn't do it. This is an innocent woman. She didn't do it. I tried to save his life. Yeah. I tried to save his life at 6 in the morning. I was covered in his blood. I was the only one trying to save his life. Why do you admit to it? He didn't, she didn't admit to it. She didn't admit to anything close to that. Nothing close to that. And you should know that. I was like three or four times she admitted to it. No, no, she didn't. That's not true. She asked a question. She asked a question, which is very different. She I didn't admit to point. anything. I just I Now you can see you can see passion on both sides. Karen Reed supporters were there, and uh, other opposition as well, both there for that moment. Now, what's next for the defense? Well, moving forward, they have one job, and that's to prove that Karen Reed did not have anything to do with the death of John O'Keefe. They don't have to determine who did. They simply have to prove that she was not involved. Now, again, tomorrow's pretrial hearing will not happen. There will be a pretrial hearing on July 27th. In Dedham, Laura Hayfley, WBZ News.